Hello there, fellow YouTubers, and welcome to a very tired Mahoney and Adam. Um, yeah, we haven't just got back. We've been back about an hour, hour and a half. Yeah, it's been a busy day. There's been like a little Comic Con at Southampton, which I had all intentions of doing a video, and then I couldn't be bothered. Um, yeah, we've got a joint haul. I'm sure you will find another haul on this fellow's um, video channel thing when it gets back home um, but yeah we're gonna do shop order so we're gonna do Forbidden Planet first then where did we go after that? We were at the con. Yeah but then we went to the con then we went to Loft Ladder and then KFC but we've got nothing to show from KFC. No. All in, all in, all in the stomach. And I'm all summary today. Look at that sleeveless. Stephen Amell shirt. Don in it. I've um, uh, spider my shirt. Press me doodah, I don't need to press doodah. No, don't um, do it. I'm tired. My hand <laughs> is going to go. I've got quite a wad from Forbidden Planet because it's been five five weeks. Five week haul. Yeah. Yeah. I only got a few from Forbidden Planet because, of course, I've still got my pool to get from Exeter, yes. my local shop. But the first comic I'm going to show you is We Stand on Guard. The new Brian K. Vaughan image title. No. Apparently, it's like how the way Mark explained the plot to the story is a sequel to World War Two. Yeah, yeah, I remember saying that. It's a sequel that. to a war between Canada and America. Yeah. Interesting, interesting enough. It looks like it takes place in the future with like mechs and robots and that. But the next World War could be happening soon. Hopefully not. Yeah, Hopefully not know. in my lifetime. So yeah. yeah. Looking forward to reading that. Then my very good friend yeah. put this to one side for me because you already got this one yeah. from eBay. Probably a place in space. Place in space on eBay. Yeah, it could be. Yeah. Anyway, it's Amazing Spider-Man. Renew your fouls to Scott Young. That's nice, isn't it? Yeah. That's one of his better Secret Wars ones, I think. Cool. Yeah. That's why yeah. the comics are falling. That's okay. So yeah, I've already read this one. You haven't read it yet, have you? No, I... I haven't read a lot. <laughs> I thought it was. I thought it was really good. I thought it was really good. Yeah. I really liked it. So yeah, got that one. Someone to read pile. And of course, my very good friend yeah. pointed this one out to me. Uh, Ultimate End issue two variant. Yeah. Where Miles is holding, what was it? Brian Michael Grendis. Mex oh, is it? I said Gwen. Ah. Yeah, yeah, it's Brian Michael Ben. Brian Michael Bendis as Gwen Stacy. Oh. Of course, it's an homage to Amazing Spider-Man 122, where Green I Goblin killed Gwen Stacy. I believe so. I really, yeah, I like that one. I didn't realize it was a Gwen Stacy variant. Yeah, I, I think it's a Gwen Stacy or Brian, Brian Michael Bendis variant. Yeah. It's probably Gwen Stacy because they're doing Gwen Stacy yeah. a lot recently. Yeah. And the last one I got from Forbidden Planet is Convergence Harley Quinn issue two. I bought the first one, I liked it, didn't really love it, but Mark, short box long, or previously known as MAW00001, yes, I remember. he recommended this one to me. I thought, well, if Mark likes a new 52 book, it must be, it must be good. <laughs> Plus it was 99p, so you couldn't exactly go wrong. And that was what I picked up from Forbid, for Forbidden Planet. And you didn't get much, did you? You didn't get a lot. Yeah. For some people, that's quite small. No, well, to yeah, to Mark. For me, that's like humongous. For Mark, that's like yeah. min minuscule. Um, first thing I'll show. Oh, this is very. I'm super jealous of this. I've got to try and unfold it. I've forbidden planet guys, especially Phil. He does look after us. Phil. Um, if you're watching Phil, it's Phil. I hope it's Phil. No, I've got him on Facebook. He's you just made a tit of yourself. Really. Yeah. He's not called Phil. Um, he's put. I don't think they've even. Oh crap, I don't want to ruin it. I don't think he's even put this on display. Oh my god. Am I in the shot? Yeah, no. It's the A. Yeah. Lou Marvel <laughs> A versus X poster. Which yeah. will be going into your new nerd room. Yes, when we're all set up. All set up and moved out. I can't fold it. That's the problem with posters. They're easy to unfold, but you can never fold it back up, can you? Well. Ah, there we go. There, there we go. Are. Simple, there we go. simple mathematics. So we got that. I don't need to buy the comic now. What, I'm, what? I'm talking like I'm drunk. You don't need to buy. I'm, it. I'm not drunk. No. I'm just 
tired. Tired. You don't need to buy the comic now. Yes, because I got the poster. Yeah, but no, you can't read a poster though. The story's not in the read poster. It. It's all right. But, oh, <laughs> just read the poster. Yeah, just don't. Adam Butterfield, 2015. Yeah. I if you, if you can't get the comic, read the poster. Yeah, it's sort of the lithographs. It's cheaper to get the lithographs than the actual cover. And we all know my um, issue with Scotty Young at the moment. So yeah, I just make sure I've got now Scotty Young's in here. <laughs> yeah, you all know my views of Scotty Young at the yeah. moment. Um, anyway, um, I have got some variants. Not Scotty Young. Oh, crap. First off, we have. I've pre back and board these already. I'm all professional today. All prepared. Um, all new X Men, last issue. Um, how are the duck variant? And that one. Sad that's coming to an end. Ah. Hey, I recognise <laughs> that one. We have Ultimate End, Issue 2. What did we say it was? A Brian, Brian Michael, Michael Gwendes variant. Yeah, I did have the original. I tend to, like, when I go to Forbidden Planet, they'll put the normal variants in and then I'll check for the Bad Mahounis in it today. I will check for the variants that I like. Yeah, so exactly. I had the original for both these two. Um, couldn't find a variant for this. Ooh. Oh, you little buggers. Oh, get, get your bakes being a bit yeah. frisky. Yeah, I do. Yeah, just put it on there. Yeah. Behind yeah. the scenes. That's it, that's it. A bit of BTS. Tiny's being a bit aggressive with his yeah. water bottle. Uh, these are in no particular order. This is a uh, Ultimate End Issue 3. Bog standard variant. Do we call these ones? Secret Stacey Gwen Stacy variants of Secret Wars number four. Oh. Oh shit. Oh uh, what? Uh oh. Uh oh. What's wrong? Were you were you not meant to get get this one? I meant to get. That's not Battle War. Battle. No, it's the Secret Wars. I've already shelled Battle World. Ah, oh, oh. it's Ultimate End. Yeah. I'm tired. Um, then yeah, show. I'll show it for you. Is he tired? Is he tired? <laughs> uh, Secret Wars issue four. Uh, Chris Sam, the variant of the Gwen Stacy. Yeah, and you can do it better than me as well. I uh, thought I'd. Yeah, but I'd already showed the variant for issue two of Ultimate yeah, End. Yeah, you just got really confused. Yeah. yeah. With your uh, Gwen Stacy's. <laughs> uh, next we have uh, Turtles issue forty-seven. A shot. cover B. I believe it's the Kevin Eastman. Cover. Uh, got a clue. Yeah, 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 There's one or two, and I went for that one. The, I love this variant. Sex variant. I think this is cover. The what variant? B. Sex variant. Sexy. Oh, sexy. 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 He just said sex variant. Sexy. I'd, yeah. I was going to say what? I don't think there's no sex now. But this is uh, Wayward issue nine. I haven't read any of it yet. Ah, oh, brilliant. It's good. Brilliant, really yeah? good. Yeah, recommend. Yeah. Highly recommend it. I think the girl in Forbidden Planet says she just picked up the trade and says how much she enjoyed it as well. Fair um, Outcast issue 10. Still picking it up. Still going good? Yeah. Still like it? It died and then it's threw coming me back, back yeah, in it's again. Back a bit. Um, it's just one. Bog standard, isn't it? That one? Yeah. yeah. 18.1 of Amazing Spider Man. Bog standard variant. Still a nice cover, though. Yeah. Yeah. Cover, that. yeah. I think it's film. I, believe, I can't check because my phone's there. Uh, sorry, distracted from the outside as <laughs> well. Um, this is a variant by... I don't know. Okay. <laughs> this is a 19.1. But I like the variant, so I, I like, like the variant. Yeah, I think I've picked out another sort of... Cover price as well. Not Good bad. thing about okay, Forbidden yeah. Planet, a lot of the... Uh, Some of the variants. Yeah. There, yeah. Um, Birthright, another good one. Birthright issue 8. Another recommendation from me, Michael and Mike. Yeah. Very good, yeah. Got the first issue, still haven't read it yet. Yeah, I, I got the trade from NSCC, read that, and then I saw issue, issue six for like one pound twenty-five so or something. We so I just, just it. yeah, carried on with that. Um, <laughs> it's quite a lot. Quite a lot, of legs. I thought this had finished, so I thought no more DC. No more. Yeah, this is Arrow season two point five issue nine. Have all of the covers got like shirtless men on them? Well. One to eight was like, um, like TV covers. TV covers, and then this one's just gone to like comic book. Yeah, hot. I mean, it's still hot. Yeah, it's still shirtless. Yeah. 
Okay. I'll put this down here. Put them down <laughs> before they go all, go all over the place. Um, you haven't seen the video already, or you might do, but I have got the so Scott Young variant of this, and this is uh, Spider Man Renew Your Vows. I love this cover, so I had to pick up this as well. It's a lovely cover. Yeah. And I've read, yeah, as I said earlier, I've read it. Yeah. And I really didn't really enjoy it. It's that. one of the ones to read. Ah, oh, you little buggers. Will you carry on, I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> Um, next off, it's been a long time coming. Uh, this is Death Vigil number seven. What's that about? In, f in one word, what's it about? I don't know. It reminds me of Final Fantasy. Oh, that, that was more than one word. Summons and stuff like that's, that. Well, that's, um, that's like two sentences now, but I'll give like, you that. She's deaf and she's forming up a group oh. sort of thing, like Lady Death. Yeah. To fight the battle of evil and, and stuff. <laughs> and stuff. I really recommend this as well, even though I've sold it to Mahoney and the guys watching. Already? Yeah. Can't wait um, to pick that up. <laughs> this is this ain't a variant, is it? No. No. Look at them tattoos as well. Yeah. Legs wide open, Ian. Yeah. It's got, it's got the curve on that. Yeah. Anyway, this is Spider Pass issue two. <laughs> <laughs> Secret was tying. I'm not way behind. This is the Secret Wars tie-in. I still haven't read the first one, yet. Oh, I don't so know. behind. Oh. Oh. The end. The end is here. Alex and Ada, issue 15. Would you recommend that one? Fuck yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it, this has probably been my... Uh, Your favourite Even if you include image. Walking Dead, it's probably my favourite title that I've read. Alex and Ada. It, it's, it's, I don't know if you're saying racist. It's kind of like a chick book but it's, it's the love story is, is brilliant there's nothing racist about that it's a chick book yeah there's nothing it's racist about it not racist sexist, sexist. Oh. <laughs> um, if you're watching Humans on Channel 4 I don't know what channel it's on in America channel. Um, it reminds me of that yeah so much um, last but not least my one of my favourite I don't know if tiles. I've got a variant so I just picked up this one um, issue eight of spread. Love, love spread. I kind of lost the love. It's, it's the same with a lot of stuff. I lose the love and then I bring it back. Uh, I've got 120% yeah. love for spread. Love it. Oh, oh. Bit of a damaged copy, Phil. I know that wouldn't have been Phil. No, he just sort sent me uh, posters. Oh, there you go. Um, so yeah, that's it from Forbidden Planet. Um, good word, good word of comics. Where do we go next? Next up is the con. The con, the con. Should we quickly talk about the con? Yeah, it was alright. Yeah. <laughs> it was about six or seven stalls. In the middle of like a shopping centre. Yeah, it was, if you now say Fountain, it was in West Key on the bottom floor. Um, you had that bird from Farscape. I don't even know who she is, but she's had plastic surgery. Oh, God, she looked like <laughs> Joanna Lumley. <laughs> yeah. um, you had the Simpsons coach you could take your pictures on. Um, With the Simpsons coach. What, there's someone else there behind, like, a screen or something? No. Oh, God. And then you had someone who was the stunt double for Rocky Raccoon. How does that even work? Uh, fucking hell. Um, but, yeah, it was all right. It was free to enter. We was going to Southampton anyway. So. So we, we we didn't go our way. Yeah, did, but you did. <laughs> well, no, I came here to see you guys. Yeah, yeah, but it was all right for a freebie. Yeah, so um, right. we got a few bits. So let's see what we showed off. Yeah, yeah. Should, I shall I? I've only got two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. First comic I picked up was Secret Wars issue three, the action figure variant. Been hunting this one for a while. I'm trying to get all the action figure variants. And where did you get that from? I got that from, oh, I like that. <laughs> My local store from Exeter, Moving Pictures. They travelled all the way up here as well. Yeah. And I said they could have given you a lift. They could have. So come on the Friday. Yeah, but pff, I don't want, want to bother them, you know. Yeah, yeah but it's, it's early sure. Friday. I, I'm not getting up. Yeah, and I would have been up. in bed still. So. Yeah, so anyway, Secret Wars, yeah, <laughs> issue three. And this one, I wanted to come here because I had a bit of m money on me. I wanted to get a nice key issue. I thought I saw the first appearance of Fission. They wanted two hundred and twenty-five pounds. I yeah, said, "You carry that kind of uh, Yeah, I was like, "Nope." 
Who do you think you are? What kind of Comic Con do you think this is? Yeah. So instead, I went for the next best thing. Who I'm... who created Vision? Ultron. Who created Ultron? Tony Stark and Bruce Banner. <laughs> they did in the movie. Who created Ultron in the comics? Ant Man. Ant Man. And who is Ant Man's alter ego? Of course it is. Yellow Jacket. Avengers issue 59, the first appearance of Yellow Jacket. If I'm remembering the origin story correctly, Hank Pym went on a bit of a hiatus and came back as Yellow Jacket. Okay. A, more, a more meaner, more aggressive Ant-Man. Still the same powers as that, but he's more kick-ass. So the movie's kind of like... Yeah, the movie, they um, took a feminist route to the Yellow Jacket character. Okay. I, I don't know Ant-Man. So yeah, I'm really glad I got got this. Paid. I think I paid a really good price for what when the movies c c coming out and that. I think I paid a really good <laughs> price. Of course, I took the price off. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, really glad I got that. I'm really glad I I, I said I was going to come here and get a key issue, and that's what I got. Yeah, my my challenge was to get uh, Legacy Saba. Uh, and oh, it's got a no, no it's not here. And then I saw a Captain America shield for ninety pound. And. I couldn't afford it. Not here. No. So show, but yeah, show us what you did get. Yeah. I, oh <laughs> I do believe that this was a key issue. It's key to any Flash Thompson fan. Yeah. If, 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 if there's about ten of them in the world. I want to sit in here. No, I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm an Agent yeah. Venom fan. Yeah, yeah. I like Flash Thompson. Though. Um, and I got this. I think it's free. Three fifty. And this is Amazing Spider-Man five seven four. The issue where I told you he this. loses his legs in Afghanistan. Afghanistan. I was yeah. going to say Vietnam. <laughs> Great. <laughs> yeah. Talking about that, you know, Magne you're like Magneto. His origin story is set in World War Two, like in the concentration camps. Yeah. About ten years or twenty years down the line, they're going to have to change his origin story because he'll just be way too old. Yeah. How do you think they're going to do that? Well, it's like they've kept Peter Parker like really young, and they was yeah. using a mobile phone. That's true. Yeah. Comics and timelines are weird. Secret Wars is going to sort all that. Yeah, yeah. That's all right. So where did we go next, Adam? I'm still at the con. No, he's still at the con. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, we went to the next stall. Because I believe we got that from the same stall, the same guy, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and then I saw these at the start of the con. Oh, have you shown that off? Oh, yeah, if you've got more, more stuff from the con. Oh, Maze is fast, though. It's just about... <laughs> Oh no, just waiting there. Um, I'll, I'll do these quickly. These were like free for ten pound each. So I got these are for the new house. I've got this one. Sexy. I haven't watched one episode of Arrow Ooh. or Flash oh, or this Agents one. of Shield. I do admit that's a pretty nice poster. Yeah. There. And they're all like not like my Black Cat one where they're crap. <laughs> these are nice quality. My slam. And this was the original one that I wanted. And I, obviously I got it, because it's here. Um, <laughs> this one is just absolutely sexy. That's a sexy one. Both Flash and Arrow. Yeah. But so I, I wanted to get them. So yeah, we're yeah. showing off. I got this at the same store. I I watched Game of Thrones. I'm on season three at the Sorry. moment. Really, I'm not getting into Game of Thrones. I don't really like it, but my girlfriend loves it. So I thought I'll get her a little treat. Uh, a picture of Jon Snow, I think the character is, signed by the actor Kit Hutchinson. No, no. So any of you Game of Thrones fans, there you go. But it's not going to me, it's going to my lovely girlfriend. So it's signed as well. Signed as well, uh, just across the body there. Oh, that's right. And certificate at the back. Yeah. Cool. Deal. Um, yeah. And then we went to the Loft Ladder. Loft Ladder. Lovely place. I really enjoyed it. Southampton Comics, which Mahoney bought some stuff from, but I didn't. I only got two I did, stuff. but I've already got it, so I'm not showing it off. Like, I saw these, like, straight away. I thought, yes, I'm grabbing them. Yeah. Especially with the recent announcement of uh, Punisher being in yeah. Daredevil Season 2 Netflix yeah. series. Have you watched Daredevil yet? Yeah. Oh, I love it. Yeah, really good. That's, that's, the one, yeah, well. that's the one show I have watched. Yeah. <laughs> I love yeah. it. Uh, this is Daredevil issue 184. This is part of the Frank Miller one. I love that cover. 
Yeah. That cover's so badass. Love it. And I believe this is a hot comic at, at the moment. Hot. Because it's the first, uh, appear a first appearance of Punisher in, in the Daredevil book. Okay, that's cool. I believe so. Correct me if I'm wrong. I, so, can't, I, don't, I, don't. I don't know. <laughs> I just saw it. I know these books are hot yeah. at the moment, so I thought might as well go in by the low in price. And I also got Daredevil 183. Nice. 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 Frank Miller's artwork was so good back then. Okay, we got shot in the shot in the gut, yeah. yeah. But you can tell from this issue, he got better. Yes. The issue he's got the gun. He's got the gun. No more yeah. Mr. Nice Guy. So yeah, glad I got that. I believe there's another issue after after that. I show this one anyway. Show it anyway. Yeah. I um I got this one because I, I want to show which Spidey I was after. I pointed that out. Saying, yeah. Oh, Adam, have you got this? And I didn't know. But it's uh, Amazing Spider Man. Uh, Amazing Spider Man 595. So I now have two copies. So I'm so going to sell one. If you're missing one, comment down below. 20 quid. 20 quid. Yeah. Bargain. Yeah. Ain't you forgetting your little friend sat here? No, because then <gasps> my mate Rob. Rob? I can't remember his shop's name, but it's based on retro video games you've heard me talk about in previous videos. If you've watched previous videos, if not, Southampton, Loft Ladder, Rob. Special. Yeah. Um, I basically have done a trade with him. I've got a few things I want to tech up to him next month. Um, and I've traded them for these. Look at them. I saw them, I thought, yes, I want them. And I said, will you trade for shitloads of stuff? And he said, yes. I said, just take them, just take them. So I did. Brilliant guy. If you're down Southampton and you like retro games. Check it out. Yeah. And if you like comics, go to. The Loft Ladder. Yeah. Check it out. Really good. Um, and the heads move. The heads move? Articulation. I think these are the ones you get in the grab bags, I think. I thought you get the like, free cards. It looks like well. something you get off like a, like a McDonald's. <laughs> <laughs> you got a grab bag, you got this, and then you got a Power Ranger card as well. Well, you got the two coolest ones. Yeah. Well, I didn't get the Green Ranger. Yeah, well. But they were pretty much free anyway, so. They're free. At the moment, I ain't paid for them. So, yeah, that was our day out. Yeah, sweaty. Sweaty, very tired. Yeah, long haul video. I, I will wait to upload this because I've got a previous haul video to upload which shows um, eBay boys and a Tesco buy. And that was it. So yeah, uh, that's it. Uh, thumbs up if you like the video. Thumbs down if you don't. Comment. Subscribe. The original worker of this this maneuver. Wait, wait, I think it's down there. Yeah, it's down there now. Down there. Um, and all I have to say is, thrip it. I've shortened it. Live longer, prosper, and nanu nanu. Bah.